I also really hate modern bras. Yeah. Like, yeah, I can't really, I don't know if you could, can. Could you just tell I, me? The silhouette is not good, you know? Like, like back at, back then, the silhouette was more perky. Uh -huh. Like, 50s was the bullet bra pointy. Okay. I, that's, I like that, but I, I really more like the 60s or the 40s kind of like slightly perky kind of like, I don't know. I took a stand-up comedy class in college, uh -huh. and I just kind of took it for fun because it was a, I had just transferred to this university, I didn't really have any friends, and I thought, that's a good way to meet friends. And then I saw like Judy Tenuta, and I don't even know Judy Tenuta's stuff, but I saw this one clip of her where she like made an audience member drink water out of her shoe, <laughs> and I was just like, wow, that's crazy, I love it. I remember this later, but in middle school, I actually... Um, was in a like the middle school like talent show, yeah. and I stole <laughs> this comedian's act that I saw on Comedy Central, and I just looked up this comedian, and he was even just kind of weird, you know. His name's like Haywood Banks, and one of his big bits was he wore a toaster around his neck, and he had a fork and a knife, and he'd play the toaster, and he sang a song about toast. Rosencrown days, I still kind of dressed in a like skirt and top kind of thing, mm. like kind of feminine, I guess. But um, and I, I always liked vintage because I, I I even dressed vintage like in, in high school and stuff. Kevin Avery um, kind of introduced me to the punchline. We went there together, and I was wearing jeans and like a t-shirt and like sneakers and everything, yeah. and it was. Like, I look back on it, I'm like, oh, geez, you know? Well, part of the whole vintage love, passion, it's like what I've wanted to do is like, learn how to sew and knit and crochet so I can make authentic um, clothes from those times mm. using the patterns. You know, I have, I have these like really amazing like patterns from mm. like the 50s. This is from the 60s. I know the early 60s this is a very Mad Men. But like, oh, and I got, ooh, these. These are really cool. Yeah, and this is like a knitting book from the 50s. Just look how beautiful these women are. I don't know, can you see that? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, and look at these sexy short shorts. I mean, that's cute, you know? Back in, you know, 2006 or whatever, when I first started doing comedy, and when I worked for Frank Shamrock, I, Frank Shamrock had a video camera, and so uh, that's when I started making YouTube videos, um, and I got really into it, and I just made a bunch, you know? And then I heard about this website called Nerve.com, which was like, um, it's kind of known for personals, for uh, dating, but it's also kind of like a, kind of classy literary kind of like, they talk, it's like a sex magazine, but it's kind of like nerdy, hip kind of vibe. I emailed them, was like, hey, I have these videos, you might be interested in them. And they're like, yeah, we love you, where have you been all our lives? Yeah. <laughs> and so they put up my videos and I had like a page on that Nerve.com site. Um, IFC like somehow got connected with Nerve, I think because they're both in New York. And um, Nerve also had these other videos on their site. And one of them was this video series called Young American Bodies. And it was um, uh, pretty highly acclaimed. And uh, basically, IFC was like, we like, we like these videos, and we want to have them on IFC.com. And so they're like, well, what can we do that would be like a web series kind of show? And he was like, maybe if you have like, you probably have a crush on a guy. And I'm like, yeah, I totally, you know, that's my thing. It's like I have crushes on guys, you know. Okay. And and I told him, well, I've always kind of like had a crush on Gavin Newsom, so. Guys. Can yeah, come over here. Camera? Well, so she, she, I, this is her. So okay, okay. No, you no, no, Mary, I, I, want you, I want you in. I want you in, Mary. You could do this one. No, so. I want her to. I could, I could sit creepily. <laughs> you could sit do something the, creepy. Sit on the fireplace. <laughs> I could, I could you could do something creepy. Okay, okay, let's just. Alright.
sleep in the rain And now I'm the sand you lay away And if I had to say No one's to play Hey.